Hey guys, it's John of Figurative Arc. We've done a series of how-to videos looking at the VSDC free video editor about how to add text, how to splice, add video, how to splice and add audio, apply special effects, and to convert your project into your favorite format. Today's tutorial is very specific and it's answering a question that one of my subscribers asked and he asked me to do a video of how to repeat an audio file. So in other words, if you've got, let's say, a video clip and the sound file that accompanies it is not long enough and you want it to repeat again, how do you do that? So I'm going to do a, a really quick video on that. So I've already opened the editor. I'm going to go to the editor tab. I'm going to go into add objects and, and go click on audio. I'm going to go ahead and click on this. This is asking you where do you want this file to start. I'm going to say I want it to start at the beginning of the scene. And there it is. So again, let's say this isn't long enough. So what I would do is I have my mouse kind of on the timeline here, and I'm just going to kind of drag it to the end of this audio file. Now, there are really two ways of doing this. You can go back in and you can add it again, just like I just did. And now I'm going to say, I wanted to start from where my cursor is. So I'm going to do that. And there it is. Uh, another way that you could do it, if you wanted to, is you could go in here and copy the audio file, and then you could paste it. So that's another way of doing it. I'm going to go ahead and delete it since it's twice there. So you can copy or add an object as many times as you want to get it to the length that you want. But let's say that yours is shorter than this amount of time. I can hover my mouse and very simply, as you can see, I'm just shortening that. And let's say because you've shortened this, it's a very abrupt cut. So all of a sudden it just cuts out because it's not at the end as it normally would be. So for that, you would just click on this and you would go to audio effects and you could fade it out. And this is just saying you're going to have it fade out at the scene end and this is how long you want it to fade out. So you can make that anything that you want. Maybe it's two seconds. And that way it will fade out at the very end. So that's, again, how to repeat an audio file. If you want more detailed information about how to splice an audio file video and the other things that we mentioned before, then please check out the other videos. It goes into a lot more depth than this specific question. So I appreciate your watching. Please consider subscribing if you like how-to videos like this. I also am involved in making short films. I have a blog and a website where I show some of my figurative photography. So feel free to check that out and hope to see you again here sometime soon. Bye.